Social Analytic Group, NEXA, has suggested a non-kinetic approach in the resolution of the violent and security situations across the country. The group gave the suggestion in the next year 2023-2024 first quarter violent conflict report presented in Abuja. Partner of next year, Mr. Ndubizi Mwokolo, explained that the report suggested that the sit-at-home phenomenon in the southeast and other security threats around the country which disrupted economic activities could be resolved through dialogue and understanding. If we are deploying our military, our police, everything to all the states and we are not getting results, why are we not looking at other alternatives? You, we are deploying and we are not getting the result. Are there ways we can start talking? talking as a people, are there things we can do? Are these only security issues? Are these political issues? Are these economic issues? So if we look at other issues and compare it to what, what our guns and nominations have done for us, could we be charting another course? So if we start talking, if we start pulling our resources together, more towards peace building than security, I think we'll start getting results. The policy and research consultant of the group, Mrs. Ndidi, Ayawu blamed the involvement of youths in violent activities on unemployment. We are not anticipating that while um, repressive measures might not immediately work or might achieve just um, temporary stability for a much more durable or sustainable um, peace in the southeast, a combination of both kinetic and non-kinetic measures will be able to first address the violence and then on the non-kinetic side address the agitations or the social injustice or the perceptions of marginalization and whatnot that people are using or are fueling such um, um, secessionism or agitations. Most of the um, people who take to this crime, from what I've seen so far, majority of them tend to be young people. Yeah, and then Nigeria is still, we have a lot of, uh, of citizens who are still poor. So there is that conversation that unemployment, poverty are some of the issues driving this conflict. And like he mentioned, there are economic implications to this things. If we are not doing enough you know, to, to harness these issues or to build the capacity of the young people to have some sort of livelihood, I say if, um, nature ab abhors vacuum, if you're not doing anything. An idle man is an idle uh, hand, right? So there is that tendency that people want to feed, people want to eat. So whatever is there that will provide them something to eat, they will do that. There's been an increase in the number of um, people who have been kidnapped. And if you check, kidnapping is basically kidnapping for ransom. Next year emphasized the importance of a broad-based national dialogue to resolve security issues across the country in its recommendations.